Every concept taught in the Electricity for HVAC simulation is initiated via the training mode. Once you choose your scenario, you will see that you have a very versatile learning environment. In this case, I've pulled up the residential AC wiring diagram. At the bottom of the screen, you will see the control panel for this wiring diagram. Each element is adjustable. The system switch turns on and off. The fan switch allows you to replicate different fan variables. The thermostat and space temperatures are also easily adjustable to generate different scenarios. Most importantly, E4H has the ability to set a fault on each individual component, creating a dynamic environment for learning. In this case, I've set a fault on the IFR. I can now pull out the multimeter and test the effects with or without a fault. Individuals can extend their own learning via the tutorial mode available for each diagram in E4H. Once initiated through the magnifying glass icon, learners can follow the prompts to learn specific concepts. This direct instruction is also a great way to learn how to use the entire simulation. After following all the prompts, you can successfully complete the training mode for that diagram. Your completion is tracked via the progress area in the badge section. Keep up the hard work.